The front or head of a piercing tool experiences the majority of wear during operation. The replaceable head or wear face helps protect the body from wear, prolonging the life of the tool body, which is the most expensive component to replace. The Hammerhead line of piercing tools includes three models with either a fixed or reciprocating head style. A replaceable head tool has a wear face affixed to the body that is static. Piercing tools that feature a reciprocating head are not covered in this tutorial. Please refer to the training video that fits your tool model. Secure the piercing tool using either a pipe stand or a chain wrench. Perform a general inspection of the exterior of the tool. Start by inspecting the tool body. Check for cracks, severe wear, and damage from utility strikes. Replace the body assembly when necessary, as damage could lead to future failure. Before inspecting the head assembly, clean the head using a wire brush. Inspect the head assembly. Shown here is a new, replaceable head assembly. The head assembly must be replaced when the wear face is worn nearly through to the body. The replaceable head assembly is composed of two components, the replaceable wear face and anvil nut, or nose bolt. To remove the wear face, use a pipe wrench or a crescent wrench to remove the anvil nut. With a ball peen hammer, strike the wear face to free it from the body. This may take several impacts. Remove the wear face from the body. Clean and inspect the tapered portion of the body surface and front anvil threads. Prepare the surfaces for the new installation by liberally coating the body, front anvil, and new wear face with anti-seize. Install the new wear face. Coat the anvil nut mating surface and front anvil threads with anti-seize. Install the anvil nut and torque to the manufacturer's specifications. Following a regular service schedule will keep your hammerhead mole piercing tools running at maximum efficiency.